for years, it's usually the defense is ahead. Um, I think that's pretty much been the case this year as well, but I, and I see the offense um, really the last two practices, you know, really making some pretty good strides. Um, it's also hard just, you know, early on when to decide that because the installations, there's still a lot of new stuff going in every single, you know, day on both sides of the ball. We're a little bit more experienced on the defensive side, but but I'm pleased. I thought the last two days it's been very competitive back and forth. Yeah, you're about midway through practice. Where are you with respect to the quarterback competition, and do you have a time frame now that that opener is kind of creeping close to it? Yeah, you know, we'll, we literally are, are just finishing up the installations, getting all the installs in on, on offense and defense, and, and we do that on purpose kind of spread it out and it's complimentary so the offensive coaches know what's going in on defense the defensive coaches know what's going on offense so you can prepare the guys to come out and be successful um, you know and making sure that the right amounts you know because it, it compounds so it's not just what you're putting on uh, putting in on defense it's what you're seeing on offense um, so you know when it comes to the quarterbacks we're going to get through the installs first and then just kind of go from there but um, Obviously, we're evaluating everything. I think both Clifford and Levis are doing some really nice things. The two young kids are starting to get more comfortable too. So, um, you know, we, we've been pleased, but it, we haven't had one discussion yet as a staff on on making decisions. James, how is